Screw Gauge Let's understand the working of a screw gauge. The main parts of a screw gauge are Stud Screw Frame Pitch Scale Circular Scale Thimble and Ratchet Aim To find the volume of a lead shot, a wire in an irregular lamina along with the thickness of a glass plate. Pitch of the screw gauge Rotate the screw backward about 4 times and note the distance moved on the pitch scale. Number of full rotations given to the screw is equal to 4. Distance moved by the screw is equal to 4 mm. Hence, pitch is equal to 4 mm divided by 4, which is equal to 1 mm. We can find the least count of the screw gauge by using the equation. Least count is equal to pitch divided by total number of divisions on the head scale. The screw is rotated forward till the tip just touches the stud. Note the zero coincidence of the circular scale with the zero of the pitch scale. Zero error is equal to plus three divisions. Zero correction is equal to minus three divisions, which is equal to minus 0.03 millimeters. Glass plate. Materials required. screw gauge and the glass plate. The screw is working backwards. The given glass plate is gripped between the tip of the screw and the stud by working the screw forward. Note the pitch scale reading and head scale reading. Tabulate the observations. Wire Materials required Screw gauge and wire The given wire is gently gripped between the stud and screw by working the screw forward. Note the pitch scale reading and the head scale reading. Move the screw backward and measure the length of the wire using a scale. Volume of the wire V is equal to pi into D by 2 the whole square into L. That is equal to 3.14 into 0 0.045 by 2 the whole square into 13 which is equal to 0 0.0207 centimeters cubed.